Hello and welcome back to War Battle. and today we're going to be playing with a bit of a risky strategy. Well, hello there, friends. We're going to be playing as the Lucid and we are going full radioactive. Let's, that's right, we're going to be playing a lot with the, uh, Oh, the nuclear plant. If you guys haven't seen it before, greetings, friends. Let's go ahead and send them a greetings emote as well. Hello there. Uh, what we're going to be doing is playing around with the uh, nuclear uh, reactor. Basically, what it does is it increases the charge speed of well, all the things on your planet, including the upgrade speeds and, well, everything else. Charge times, rate of fire, and again, and the reason I'm playing with the Lucid is because at Tier 3, we unlock this item called the Cataclysm. It's designed to blow up planets, but uh, instead just kind of creates a giant uh, planet-destroying volcano that blows up the planet. And, uh, well, I want to have as many of those as possible. Because the biggest downside of the Cataclysm is you can only have one of them, and they have a very long reload time. It takes 75 seconds. But if I've got a lot of nuclear power plants all set up and ready to go, then it doesn't cost, well, take 75 seconds. It takes something like 20 seconds? And then you can pretty much just fire an earth-shattering ex explosive at a planet every... 25 seconds or something like that. It's really, really very powerful. So that's 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 what I'm gonna go for here. I don't need to just start setting up all these nuclear plants. Uh, the max you can have of these is uh, what is it? Is four of them? There's there's the max. You can get four, you can get four max. And obviously, it, if your nuclear plant gets destroyed, really bad things happen. Like your planet goes nuclear. So we're gonna be playing real, real risky here, but it's, it's, I think it's gonna be worth it. All we gotta do is just get all the nuclear plants going and then get it all set up. So what I'm gonna do is I, I do have four other, or three other human players in this match. And I'm gonna try to not start the fight. Although this guy seems to want to start the fight with me. I'm gonna just, oh, yep, yeah, he's, uh, he mad. He mad. Uh, do I want to, do I want to shoot back? Ideally, I don't shoot back. I, I, I just let him kind of ignore all the damage he's doing, because he's really not doing much in the way of damage. I'll see if he shoots at me again. Uh, yes, yes he is. So I'm gonna just return fire then. I think my ideal go goal is to not instigate more war, and just let it happen. There we go, yep. Yep, it looks like as long as I don't instigate war with everyone, I can get up to the, the highest tier of everything. We'll go ahead and boost nuclear production here. There we go, I think that should shoo him away for a moment. Just go back to increasing my resource generation. Farm some of these other planets so we can get the maximum speed. I think we'll be alright. Looks like my opponent here is going for some nuclear reactors in and of himself, so he sees what I'm doing here. Uh, he may try to just turn on me real quick. He's got a couple big shots. Nope, no, alright. He's being nice. He knows what he wants to do. He looks like he's doing a similar strategy himself. So I'm, I'm okay with this. Hello there. I don't know how to emote directly at someone, so I'm just gonna I'm just gonna not. But I am going to upgrade these nuclear reactors, give them the full bonus speeds. Once I get one more boost, which it costs 500 resources. All right, so now these are upgraded to level two. You can see the little animation just completing there. Yep, that that guy still wants me. No, it's it's just multi cannons. They really don't hurt much. They do a bit of damage to the uh, structures on the planet, but really don't do much damage to the planet itself. More like scraping the paint job off, which is... Eh. It's whatever. Don't really mind. So he's just gonna keep doing that. It looks like he's... Yeah, he, he seems to have angered a number of the other individuals. Uh, uh, he did shoot a couple of the other players, too. So they, they are retaliating. Uh, generally, those who shoot also get shot. Which is one of the reasons I'm not I'm not doing a lot of damage just yet. I'm gonna go ahead and upgrade my rail gun here. Or multi-gun. That way it's now level 2, does more damage, and can gain some more resources for me. If I just shoot at these uninhabited planets and gather all their goodies. Uh, sooner than later, I am going to be replacing my refineries with more resource or more guns. That way I can start dealing some serious damage to a planet. Probably this guy, because nobody likes him and nobody will be sad if he goes away. At least I suspect no one will be sad if he goes away. I suspect Yellow would be very happy with me if I made this guy go away. So I'm kind of really tempted to transition to that uh, real quick damage dealing right now. Do I want to do that? Do I want to wait? Let me upgrade this first, then save up a little bit more monies. As his orbit looks like it's faster than mine, uh, partially because we're going most of the same. All right. Is his faster than mine? I'm not sure, but he's going to be within my line of sight for a little while. 
So I will be able to uh, start hammering him should I so desire, and I think I do desire. If I... Oh, no, 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 you see? The the winning play is to just let it happen. As this is a free-for-all. This is not teams. I have no, no requirement to help someone. If I wish to win, I need to let this happen. Let those two feud it out and do the best thing for my own planet. You know, these are my own people. I can't just let my own petty vengeance get in the way. I need to... I need to do what's good for my people. And what's good for my people is getting them to a higher tech tier. Actually, I don't need to do that just yet. What I need to do is save up the monies. Let me go ahead and shoot this asteroid. You get a little bit more money for shooting asteroids as well. Uh, and also, uh, you don't get any if you miss, though, which is just not good. Unfortunately, I think those shots will spread out enough. Oh, don't hit yellow. Okay, good. This is about to be sad. I want yellow to be alive for the moment. That way, it can blow them away when it comes... Okay, now, okay, now that... That is you signing the fate. Let's go ahead and get a couple more of these. Let's upgrade to this. Sell this off in place for a cataclysm. Uh, did I? What did I? Oh, I'm sorry. I just unlocked tech level 2, not tech level 3. Never mind. That's my bad. In that case, let's go ahead and sell this off for another. Uh, where is it? Where is it? Replace. Replace that multi cam. That's what I'm looking for. Alright. Time to. Time to piss off Blue a little bit, or rather to take vengeance upon the damage he's done to me. It looks like he's almost sniped out one of my uh, nuclear reactors, which is not good for me, but I think I'll be able to suppress him enough with all these super rapid fire multi guns to stop him from dealing more damage, at least before I repair. Yeah, see those shots are collide, and they're not taking much, and he's getting his planet scathed by lasers. And I think I could just keep going like this. This one's almost, almost lined up to fire. Uh, we, we're actually a fair ways off of tech level 3. This one good to go. This one is good to go. Yes. So right now our nuclear plants are giving plus 35% uh, recharge, or weapon reload speed to these cannons. And they will, when they are upgraded to level 3, which will happen very soon, because, well, they have that... Multi, they, they stack with each other in terms of their upgrade speed. They'll be giving plus 50% each, which is going to be a lot. I misclicked. Ooh, let's not piss off yellow. I need to need to not start an interplanet intergalactic war, when instead, I could just deal with this guy. Alright, we've just upgraded our nuclear reactors to the, the plus 50% each, so these these cannons are just going to just just keep firing for very, very quickly. Yeah, that's a 12 second cooldown on these guns right now. That's kind of a lot. At least I like to think so. As usually they're closer to... What is it? Not 12 seconds. And these guys aren't even... Are these level 3 yet? I, think, I actually think these guys are level 3. Oh, what level are you? Oh, they are level 3. Oh, that's great. That is very good for me. Very bad for my enemy here. Notice that despite all these hits we're getting on him, he's not taking a lot of damage. Yes, he's, oh, that's the guy I'm shooting at. He's he's saying that he's sorry. Oh, you. Oh, you. Trying to ask for forgiveness now. How could you? You have sealed your fate already. It's fine. All right, now if I could just get a little bit more money, just get closer to tech level 3, I'd be very happy. If I could blow up these pl this derelict planet as well, get the money from that. Also, do some collateral damage to my enemy, perhaps? Let's see, where do these shots land? Are they going to him? Yes, they are. It's just what I want to see. Very good. Oh, ho, ho, look at that chunk we took out of his planet. We got some more chunks going to him as well. Let's go ahead and do that one. Very good. Okay, so now we can upgrade to tech level 3. Looks like we have an attack ship coming in. That's good for him. Let's go ahead and replace one of these rail guns. Uh, is he coming for me? Oh, that's fine. Go ahead, you waste your time over there. I'm going to replace you with a cataclysm. Go ahead. Shoot me with it. Bye. Alright, so he came into an attack ship and I just wiped him out. Uh, that was launched from this guy over here, so I'm going to retaliate in kind. Because you shot me with an attack ship. Which I think is an excellent reason to shoot you with everything that I have. You know, just in case one of your dudes decides to go rogue again and try to deal more damage to me. I can't let that happen. I gotta protect my people. Also, you have a laser lining up, which is kind of terrifying. Uh, he has another one of those, yep, right there. 
so it's a, I'm not going to fire the rest of these shots while I wait. Uh, that laser is actually going to hurt a lot. Uh, hopefully I can take it down before it, uh, I don't have weapons. I can hit it from here. Oh, that's not good. Oh, this is going to hurt a lot. Yep, that's a very slow, slow turning burn. Oh dear. I need to hit his defense, but his planet's rotating too far away. Oh, that was going to come right back to me. Alright, so the moment this is done, I'm going to cataclysm his planet. Because he can't dodge it in time. And I'm, yeah, I'm going to take some of the cataclysm damage myself. But I'm okay with this. Because now he has the cataclysm on his planet. Oh dear. Uh, that blew up my refinery. That's a nuke. Is that coming to me? It is coming to me. And I can shut that down. No, I don't. I already have nukes on my planet. Uh, and I put them there. I don't need you adding more. Very good. Now that's actually a pretty strong strategy with the uh, the dual nuclear reactors and the defenses, because those are coming online, so they could he can just kind of keep that online permanently, which is going to be very difficult for me to deal with. Because now my cataclysm is doing more damage to me than I expected. All right, let's go ahead and try to cataclysm this guy. But at least I did a fair amount of damage with the initial impact of the cataclysm. Ooh, and he's blocked it. Good for him. Time for me to deal more damage to... Do I want to blow up this planet? Nah. I mean, it's a little bit in the way, and I can kind of blow it up to get rid of everything, but I kind of also want to shoot this guy because he shot him a lot, and that's a good enough excuse to shoot him back. In fact, just him existing is a good enough excuse to shoot him back. Let's see. Cataclysm. There we go. Cataclysm is already ready again. Let's go ahead and fire that here. Because four nuclear reactors will do that to something. I can also upgrade the Cataclysm. Boost that production. I don't want to spend too much in the way of boosting my weapons from this point, uh, because I don't have any amount of uh, production. Uh, well, any large amount of production. I do have one refinery. But look how much damage this is going to do. Yeah, his planet's not going to be the same after this. I'm not going to have many shots to stop this nuke from incoming. But all I need is one, and that has been defended successfully. So now I can just kind of break Blue's planet into non existence, send off another cataclysm. He still has a cataclysm on his planet. And, oh, and his planet got knocked asunder, which may just save him from the second, doesn't even save him from the second cataclysm. Oh, that's real bad for him. Uh, he's building an evacuator, so I could stop that from happening. Looks like he's building two evacuators. His super weapon. Oh, a cataclysm coming to me. Oh, how dare you? Why would you do such a thing? What have I ever done to you besides, actually, I shot you a bit, didn't I? Is that even coming to me? What do you... I don't want it here! Go away! I... There's no way he didn't... Alright, well, I guess he either misclicked, because that's not coming back ever. This poor planet just... He did really bad things to people, and nobody likes him anymore. And he's... He's being sent off into the sun for his crimes, is what's going on with this. And I'm really worried about this player down here. He seems to know what he is doing, and I've somewhat planned for this, actually. Uh, let's go ahead and replace this with an... Oh, wait a minute. I unplanned for this. What have I done? I changed up my uh, loadout a little bit before starting this, and I was supposed to have a weapon designed to deal with uh, what he is doing. Unfortunately, I appear to have unplaced it. I don't know if the magnet shot is capable of dealing with this. But uh, this guy is definitely the biggest and probably only threat left in this match. Is this guy's... I don't know if he's has anything to deal with this? Because he's certainly having a... Yeah, even the game knows where, where we're at. Oh, yeah, that's gonna go away. So now I get to test to see if this works against his defenses. It doesn't. I don't have a weapon that can deal with his with his onslaught. Oh, that's not good. That's not good at all. Alright, in that case, uh, Cataclysm is not the right weapon for me. Cataclysm is not the right weapon at all, so I need to replace this with something small like the multi-gun. And also replace my other weapon with this. There we go. I should help out. Let's go ahead and send this. So this repels shots, this magnet. So if I go like so and activate it, this should send this out and away from me so it won't have a chance of coming back. Very good. Goodbye forever. <laughs> 
He's asking for help. Uh, well, I don't think anything can save you at this point. I certainly won't. But let's see. This is a good solution. I think, actually, aiming for the sun here is a good solution to my problem. Because I have a lot of small weapons. Meaning all I have to do is get in a couple good hits, whereas he's using larger weapons, which are uh, not so great at getting in a couple small hits. But if I get rid of the sun, then the sun gets rid of everything else. And all I have to do is get a few small hits with my shotgun-like weapons into his core, and end it, which I think ends in my favor. So I'm gonna just do this real quick. I'm gonna save the magnet shot. Uh, just in case he fires something at me, I can repel it. Oh, by him. Now let's start making ourselves a nice black hole. Alright, repel things, please. Yes, please, go away. Just clear all that away from my planet. I don't want any of that around here. None of that nonsense. It looks like the enemy uh, is also trying to create a black hole. I don't know if it's in his benefit or if he has a plan to, to deal with me in the black hole phase or if he's just trying to, um, well, go for a dramatic effect of blowing the sun because let's, let's be real, it's a lot of fun. I, I really like it. Well, there goes the sun. And he will be nice and defended from the explosion of the sun. I have the option to defend myself and shall do so right now. Yeah, he's defending himself, pushing all those shots away from him. I'm doing the same thing with my tinier version of it. Send those here. Let's go ahead and send this out. There we go, defend against that. Repel these shots this way. There we go. Send some more shots. Alright, we did make a, a solid hit. Unfortunately, it's not going to be enough. i send this out this way. Stop him from sending things to me. There we go. He has some big shots, which are tiny by comparison to the amount of weapons I'm fielding. Uh, it's still going to hurt. Unfortunately, he's doing damage to me, whereas I am not dealing damage to him. Um, that's generally how you win games. Send all those away. There we go. Huh. The whole, uh, yeah, those are coming online before I can actually deal damage to him. That's not great. Come on. Just get another hit. Ah, uh, yes, if you're firing the weapon, you can't defend. All I gotta do is get rid of... Oh, it's so close. I've almost taken out one of his nuclear reactors. Uh, does he have a super weapon available? He does not. Oh, please blow it up. Got it! That's one less that we deal with. Uh, I don't have a weapon that can stop that from that angle. That's gonna deal some damage. You got rid of one of my nuclear plants, which is gonna cause some catastrophic effects to my base. Oh dear. Oh dear. Everything is pain. Everything is pain. So I need to put this back, and then also this. Go ahead. Yes! Catapult that away. Good. Uh... He's trying to... What is he rebuilding? Is he, he is rebuilding the nuclear plant. There we go. Alright, he does have a world dislocator, which is going to be a problem. I shouldn't have fired that second shot. I knew he was going to activate that after doing the first one. I don't know why I fired the second shot, but he already has it ready to go again because those nuclear reactors are really strong. I gotta, I gotta steal that strategy. Or at least try it myself. Because uh, it's going to be interesting to deal with that. Especially in that this kind of close range scenario. All those super weapons. All those super weapons are gonna make things very, very difficult. Uh, do I actually have actually I don't remember if I have that defensive structure. I do not. No! I didn't defend. Well, fortunately, I do have the orbit restabilizer, so I could restabilize myself, which I shall do very shortly. And uh, a bit closer to the solar system and away from him. Yeah, he's just going to send those shots away for a very long time. This is going to be a match that's going to last a fair amount of time. Uh, this is a player I do recognize from the Discord. He is fairly experienced. By fairly, I mean extremely experienced. So I'm not surprised that uh, he's he knows how to stop me from doing everything. I'm curious to see how I can come back from this one. Uh, hmm. Let's go ahead and... 
I don't want to go on a collision course with him, though actually it might not be a bad idea. You know, if I go onto his same orbit, then we'll be on a collision course, and then things can get real wild real quick. Let me stop that. Alright, I'm almost ready. Let's go ahead and restabilize myself on the same orbit as him. There we go. So now we're on the same orbit and moving toward each other. So eventually we are going to collide. Like literally our planets will collide. And things will get a bit more exciting. Uh, to say the least. <laughs> uh, this is going to be fun. Alright, so do I want to keep the... I don't want to keep the orbit stabilizer. I will replace this with something else. Uh, let's go with the... Let's go with another nuclear reactor. I can't defend against that because there was a thing in the way. Oh, that's unfortunate. I have just got hit by that. Um, hmm. This is going to do a fair amount of damage to me. And probably also detonate one of my nuclear reactors, which is only going to cause more problems. Yep, yep, yep. This is not ideal. Not ideal at all. I don't think I'm going to win this one. And another one of my nuclear reactors is just about to go. Oh, yeah, there it goes. Huh. Alright. Let's put, put it back. He's launching another super weapon. Where is it? Oh, there it is. All the way over there. And all of my structures have been destroyed. Okay. Let's go ahead and put this back. Let's go ahead and put this here. I do need another nuclear plant here and here. And what do I need to put here? Another one of these. So that was really bad. So that's what it's like to get hit by a... Um... Oh god, he just blew up my nuclear plants again. No! Alright, so now I have weapons back. I can actually use them now. If I would stop getting hit by asteroids. So the solution to this is to use the laser weapon, the kind of weapon that he has, and uh, or a, a non-gravitational weapon like the sonic beam, which is what I had originally employed instead of the magnet shot. Um, it's uh, I've made a horrible mistake in not bringing a weapon to counter this type of play, uh, but I, I try and to come back from it. I would send that away, please. Just go that way. Nice, thank you. also clear the way here with all these asteroids, make them get off of the path. Yeah, he's also free, safe from all the asteroids. Because, uh, well, his his defenses also shoes them away. That's gonna be an interesting, interesting solution. I, I, I'm, good, I'm, I'm just gonna crash my planet into his planet and see what happens. That's, that's actually gonna be my tactic here. End it in glorious fire, assuming I live long enough to, to make it there. Yeah, it's just a just a little bit of scorch, nothing terrible. Let's go ahead and send that away too. None of that out of you, please. Thank you. <laughs> uh, he was worried it might hit him, which is a fair. Okay. Oh, nope, send all those away, please. No. Get away from the asteroids. Thank you. Get away from the asteroids. There are so many asteroids here, it's kind of ridiculous. Um, I'm getting brave, I'm just entirely barraged by uh, neutral asteroids. Now I'm curious as if he's going to have his world, uh, world rammer available. No! Why didn't you shoot? Why didn't you shoot? I needed you to sh Oh, now you shoot! It only took like three seconds. Uh, that was in a very unfortunate lag, but I uh, suppose it's not really going to change the outcome here. We all know we're all just going to collide. Did he just world ram himself? He did! You! You knew this was going to happen. Yeah, I could feel the lag here. You could, you could see the lag there, but he's just going to wear me down. Uh, yep, there go all of my things. All the, uh, the nukes are chain reacting. Yep, and that is going to be the end of me. All right, guys. Well, if you want to see, if you want to see more episodes just like this, make sure to hit that subscribe button and the little bell next to it, because next time we'll be the ones showing the galaxy how it's done. But for now, I'll see you guys later.